God says, for every teardrop, for every sleepless night, there is a blessing. This too shall pass. Angels have been sent to clear the way for you. The pain you are feeling won't compare to the joy that's coming. Weeping may endure for a night but joy comes in the morning. Dear God, I am very thankful for all that you have done for me. At times, I feel ashamed to turn to you for help, because I feel like you're tired of hearing me. Help me get rid of these distorted thoughts because I know they are not real. You love me. Thank you for listening, God. Strong P-R-A-Y-E-R Lord, thank you for giving this blessed day to me. Thank you for your love and the gift of life. My only request to you today, Lord, is to keep my family safe and healthy always. Cover us with your white light of protection and let no harm fall upon us. In Jesus' name, if God has helped you in your life, respond with Amen. If God is making you wait, then wait. God is trying to teach you something. God knows the right time, the right place, the right person, and the right answer to your prayers. Trust Him. God is going to come through for you at the perfect time. Keep the faith. Remember, God is good. So don't worry. You are covered by Him. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you Lord, for granting me this wonderful day. I praise you my God for all the wonderful opportunities, the food that I eat, and the roof over my head. But most importantly Lord, thank you for another day with my loved ones. Bless my family, loved ones, and friends as they also need you. May I be a blessing to others, Lord. May they see you in me. May my words glorify you. Dear God, I ask for your blessing upon the person reading this message now. Praise you, Lord. In Jesus Christ's name I pray, Amen. Heavenly Father, thank you for my family. Give them hearts that thirst and hunger to know you. Give them the strength to not be afraid but trust you. Give them the courage to stand up for what is right and to turn against evil. Protect each member of my family under the shadow of your wings and increase our bond and unity as we seek to follow after you. May they rest in you knowing that you are the God of peace peace no one else can give. Today, please keep the enemy at bay. Increase their faith. Protect them from falling into temptation. Grant them the opportunity to be a light in the darkness and to sow a seed of love to others. Whatever is making my family anxious today, I ask that you comfort them and that they can rest in your complete sovereignty. This I pray in Jesus' name, Amen. God is saying to you, You're not reading this by accident. Pray then let it go. Don't go back to it. Don't try to change it or force the outcome. Let me write your love story. If I want you to be with someone, I will make it happen with the right person. Have faith and trust me. I have someone so special waiting for you. Type Amen if you believe. Prayer for today Lord Jesus, we thank you for this new day. Lord, we humbly ask for your guidance in keeping your commandments in all that we do and wherever we go today. Help us to express our love for you not only in words but also in our actions. In your precious name, we pray. Amen.
God system, I have never left you alone. I have always been here. Maybe sometimes you feel like I'm far away but that is only because you don't choose me all the time. I am always here by your side. Type, Amen, if you believe in God. Mark 10 15 Whoever does not receive the kingdom of God as a little child will by no means enter it. Amen, Tilda, if you believe it. God is saying to you. You're not reading this by accident. And while you see no changes, everything is changing behind the scenes. God is arranging so many beautiful things while you're sitting and worrying. He's doing impossible things while you cry it out in frustration. While it looks stagnant, everything is changing. Type Amen and share if you believe. Prayer for today Heavenly Father, today, we humbly come before you. We ask for the grace to Embrace humility and a servant's heart. Please help us, Lord, to put others before ourselves and to follow Jesus' example of selfless service. We surrender our ambitions for recognition and fame, seeking only to reflect your love. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. So letting your sinful nature control your mind leads to death. But letting the Spirit control your mind leads to life and peace. Romans 8 6 God is saying to you. You're not reading this by accident. This is the sign you've been praying to see. Everything is going to work out in your life. Your health, finances, relationships, love, and family are in God's hands. He is making a way for you right now. Type Amen if you believe. Do not be afraid, do not be discouraged, for the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Joshua 1 9 Bible verse and now, just as you accepted Christ Jesus as your Lord, you must continue to follow Him. Let your roots grow down into Him, and let your lives be built on Him. Then your faith will grow strong in the truth you were taught, and you will overflow with thankfulness. Colossians 2 6 7 NLT Trust God jesus saves heavenly father as dawn breaks we thank you for this day grant us the strength wisdom and compassion to face its challenges let us be beacons of your love and encouragement to all in times of doubt remind us of your enduring love and our untapped potential we place our hopes and dreams in your hands trusting your divine plan. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. God is saying to you today, What are you worrying about? Why are you losing sleep? You may not see how it can work out, but what you can't see is me, your Heavenly Father, giving you divine favor, moving the wrong people out of the way, making all things new, and turning negative situations around. Trust my timing. Comment, Amen, if you believe. Stop overthinking. If it's in God's will it will happen and nothing will stop it. If it's not, God has a better plan. Have peace knowing that. Always remember, God will give you direction about your situation, not confusion. Ask God for peace. For God is not a God of confusion but of peace. 1 Corinthians 14.33 Comment, Amen, and follow if you trust God.
save these reminders for when you need them. God says, no matter how hard people try to bring you down, you will never go down because I am with you. People do not have control over you unless you give it to them. I love you. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. Proverbs 3 5. God created you with faith. He beckons you to trust in him with unwavering faith too. In the complexity of life, where answers aren't always clear, lean not on your limited understanding, but embrace the divine wisdom that transcends all. He is ready to guide you through the uncertainties. If you've ever felt lost in the labyrinth of life, let this be your unmistakable call. God is your compass. Dear God, you have casted out demons. You have split the seas. You have made the blind see. Please remove evil from my life, doubts, and help me to see the truth through your eyes. I love you. When you understand that God is never late, you wait differently. Let us not become weary in doing good, for at the proper time we will reap a harvest if we do not give up. Galatians 6 9 Comment, Amen, if you trust God. If something is truly from God, you will not have to force it. The things God has for you will not have to be forced. They will just come naturally. Trust that God will bring the right things into your life at the right time.